My name is Mike Harrington. I was born and raised in Anchorage, Alaska. I run a digital marketing agency for professional services firms. I started a digital marketing agency uh, in about September of 2016. I'd actually been self-employed since uh, February of 2014. I left my last official corporate job. And uh, you know, up until I met Josh uh, late last year, uh, I basically considered myself a glorified freelancer. I was taking on high paid copywriting jobs for software companies. And I was really frustrated because there'd be a month that I'd make five or 10 grand on a project. Um, and then I could easily go two or three months with no income. And it was completely unstable and I couldn't build my lifestyle around it. And uh, I was really frustrated. And I realized that, um, you know, number one, I needed more of a recurring kind of offer that would, you know, smooth out that income. But most importantly, I needed to learn how to sell and how to consistently get in front of people that were my ideal clients. And I, you know, I was relying on hope and referrals before, and it was, it was a struggle. Working with Josh, I'd say we really started out, the, out of the gate with some harsh, tough love. We went through every aspect of what I've been doing and we really got to the heart of the matter of why I was failing in certain areas. He didn't sugarcoat it and I really appreciated that because there's a lot of people that will give you kind of these feel good pep talks, find your purpose or whatever and that wasn't what I wanted and not what I needed to hear. Um, you know, I'm an adult and I can take constructive criticism if it's in my best interest. And I knew that Josh had my best interest in mind. So I'd say being willing to, being willing to learn and admit that I wasn't you know, an expert at everything and being coachable and really trusting Josh, which I already did. So um, I'd say being willing to kind of put my faith in Josh, what he's proven over the last number of years that works. You know, I don't have to reinvent the wheel because he's tested and proven these specific methods that are working right now. Um, so that accelerated my, my success completely. So the biggest challenge that I faced, um, you know, when I started to work with Josh was I've always been really comfortable giving, um, giving presentations, talking in front of people, talking on the phone, connecting with people. And I thought that was going to be enough to be able to sell and convince people to work with me. And it turns out that it wasn't. Um, I had no formal sales training. I'd never worked in a sales job before. I wasn't prepared for the amount of rejection that I would face. And this was actually prior to working with Josh. Um, and it really did a number on my mindset. I mean, there's really, none of us are robots. Rejection is part of any kind of sales, but you're gonna face rejection and you're, I don't care what anybody says, you're gonna take it personally at first because you're trying your hardest and you can really only go so long with nothing but rejection before you'll quit um, or you'll get burned out. And you know, reaching out to Josh, he made it quite clear that if we work together, um, you know, I. Rejection, you're never going to agree rid of completely, but you're going to start converting more of these into paying clients. And I got my first paying client within the first three, four weeks of working with Josh um, and really laid that, that groundwork. I think I landed the next two clients within two weeks after that. So, you know, that biggest part of getting over the rejection, but also learning how to speak to people and really influence them, um, you get over that psychological hurdle. It's like, I call it like jumping off the high dive for the first time. You're terrified, you don't know if you're gonna die, and then you do it, and then you're like, yeah, let's do it again. <clears throat> so when I came to Josh, I had zero clients. Now, I had had clients in the past for my freelance stuff. Uh, I had not signed a new client in probably four or five months. I was really frustrated. Uh, and, you know, Josh was very candid with me when we spoke on the phone. He, got, he cut right to the, the heart of the matter and said, how many clients do you have? What's your revenue like? And I said, I don't have any clients. Do you have another job? Do you have another source of, of income? I said, no. And at that point, he actually told me, you know, it would be financially irresponsible, irresponsible of me to, to have you do this. Um, but I knew for a fact that it was going to work. And so I found the money. I had savings. Um, I, you know, family helped me out a little bit. Um, and I did it. And it was one of those things when, when you commit to it and you kind of make that investment, you know, it paid for itself within under two months. And uh, you know, right now I'm sitting at six clients and that puts me over $100,000 per year annual revenue. I'd say to someone considering working with Josh and I speak with probably three of these people on a daily basis because they start to reach out to me. I think when you start to have you know, any level of success and people find out about it, uh, you know, people want to see you know, where, where there's smoke, there's fire, right? And so they ask me what's going on, what'd you do? They try to pick my brain and you know, I'm always happy to give a few tips and kind of share 
you know, where I failed and things that I'd learned. But, you know, if they press me for more, I say, you know, the guy you want to talk to and the guy who is, uh, you know, was a big factor in my success and kind of mentoring me was Josh. And, um, you know, it's not for everybody. It's, you know, it's a, it is a commitment of time and, 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 and money. And if you're not willing to commit to getting these results and actually doing the work, if you're looking for an easy button, this is not for you. Um, if you're just looking to you know, join another course, download some stuff and, and then leave, this isn't for you. And it's not for everybody. It's for people that um, are at a place where it might not be bad, or maybe it is, kind of like, with it, like where it was for me. And they want to make a change. I mean, ultimately, when working with Josh, it's, it's not just business results. You're making a transformation per personally and professionally. So if people are ready to commit like this is, and they want to do this, it's for them.